Hugo, I've, how have we not got any points there? It seemed like quite a dominant performance, but unfortunately we've come out d with defeat. Yeah, we've had a lot of the ball today, but unfortunately the one thing that counts we didn't do, which is put the ball in the net. Um, obviously the two goals we conceded disappointing, penalty and a, and a corner. But other than that, yeah, listen, you can have all the ball that you want. Uh, you can dominate the game, you know, but when it comes into the, the important part of the pitch, the business part of the pitch, yeah, we, you know, we need to do a little bit better than that. So, but at the same time, we've got to give some kudos to the goalkeeper. He's pulled up some good saves, and that's the one I thought was particularly stand out was from the free kick from Tolaj in the first half. Uh, but yeah, look, we've it's one of them. We've got to lick our wounds, and we just got to get up again tomorrow and get on with it. You know, it's like we've been result-wise punched in the nose, and we've got to fight back. That's it, isn't it? I mean, you may, maybe a little bit of switching off for the penalty, giving away the penalty, and, and at the corner, but. Other than that, it's a very good performance. Well, no, and, yeah, yeah, in those moments, particularly the, with, with corners, if you don't do your job and you switch off for a minute, it doesn't matter what level of the game you're at, you, you're going to get punished, particularly by when you've got big centre halves who are trying to score. You know, uh, So we've got to do a little bit better in those moments. We've just got to keep working on that. The away form has been something we've struggled with recently. Is, is, do you think there's any reason behind that? No, I mean, like, there's nothing that you can pinpoint. But when you get to this stage of the season, I think it's just... It, so many teams have got so much to play for. Form goes out the window. Uh, styles of play often go out the window. It's, it's just about getting the job done. Uh, which credit to Hartlepool, they got the job done today, and we didn't. And um, but like I say, we've got three games to go. We'll get up again tomorrow, and uh, we'll get ready to go again. Exactly. I think we know, don't we, that it's not over till it's over. There's still that chance, and as you say, we'll keep going. That's all you can do in, in football and in life, you know. So it's how, how you react in difficult times. What do you do? Do you stay down or do you get up off the floor and, and fight back? And I like to think that the players that we've got in the change room, whilst we haven't had a good run of form lately, it's time to get off the floor and can we start throwing some punches back? But of course, tour of duty today from the fans. 344 of them is the official number. Wow, yeah, it looked amazing. a lot, didn't it? Great noise all throughout the game. Look, uh, listen, let's, let's have it right today. Let's give them can't give them man of the match because there's men and women let's give them people of the match because their support for us is just it's unwavering it's amazing we appreciate it so much and uh, you know we're sorry that we're only I'm not sorry but it's unfortunate we couldn't give them a goal or two to, to cheer about today but uh, I think they'll go home knowing that we've had a go today it's not as though we're you know had our bellies ticked and lying down and we've had a go uh, on another day we scored some goals but so on, you know, on behalf of all the, the staff and, and the players you know it's a magnificent turnout and, and we thank them for it well I think it was quite a nice moment especially at the end there where you know you were both applauding each other and there was that moment of they did recognize that it was a good performance today yeah look they're not daft um, the supporters are they so um, I think you know when you're a supporter of any team you know when you when you turn up to watch your team play there's certain things that you expect from your team as a supporter and you know I think people can accept okay sometimes you're going to win sometimes you're going to lose but as long as you've had a go do you know what I mean I think most people will accept that you have days like this you know so it's when you have the days where you're really really poor on the ball or with your attacking intent and your defending is not great and all that sort of stuff and people you know people don't run enough or whatever it might be I get it people can, can moan in it but I think that they'll all go home tonight going do you know what the lads have had a go, they've rolled their sleeves up, it just wasn't the BR day today. But again, thanks to the great turnout and I hope they all have a safe journey home.